Within the beauty of Belize lies the forgotten community of San Mateo. San Mateo has no drainage, no sewage, and no water facilities. Because of this, the population is at risk of disease. In order to bring in water and sewer, San Mateo needs a road. From donations and fundraisers, we are raising enough money to build the road. The people of San Mateo provide the labor to build the road. First, they go way out into the lagoon to get rock and sand. It's very hard work. Then they bring it all back in their boats. Next, they unload all the sand and rock on shore. They use the rock to build the roadbed. Everybody helps. The town council is also now helping with the project. This is a map of San Mateo. Mm -hmm. And the roads go back to here. Mm -hmm. So how far do you think it'll be, need to be to um, install water in this area? How far do you well, think? Well, the, the council actually started from the beginning of the subdivision. Okay. What we're doing is all seagrass, lumber, or stone, anything that's, um, that could be used as fill, we are placing along here and we're topping it off with rock and sand. So we expect that if we're working in this way and the community with the residents are coming in this way, we're going to be small. Well, when the roads finally meet, that's at the point when central government is going to take over. Well, having the water company take over all of the, of the provision of water. And then the council will no longer have to take on that responsibility because it's ultimately the water company who should be providing. We are really excited about the building of the new roads in San Mateo and we see that as a major turning point for the community. We'll finally allow for our water pipes to be put down and for our sewerage pipes to be laid. Up until this point in time, San Mateo has had no sewer sanitation and very little uh, drinking water brought in. So we see these as both huge um, benefits to the community. The road is important to be done because they need electricity and electricity for the kids that go to school from San Mateo because sometimes like in the night when you go walking through the bridge you can fall and get hurt. I like most is the houses and persons. 